This tutorial will walk you through the e-plan submittal process. You will need to provide all the documentation necessary for a paper permit, but in electronic form. First, you will need to download and complete the appropriate forms. They can be found on the City of Mercer Island website at www.mercergov.org. Click here for a list of downloadable submission forms. Here you will find information, documentation, and the forms necessary for a complete electronic permit submittal. This section is specific for single-family residential projects. And this section is for all other project types. Download and complete the forms required for your project. All forms can be filled in using Adobe Reader or other compatible software, including Acrobat and Bluebeam Review. You can download the Adobe Reader free of charge by clicking on this link. Please note the naming convention used for the files. Since this is the initial submittal, a project number has yet to be assigned. The initial identifier is therefore the project address. The second identifier is the submittal stage, in this case the first intake submittal. Finally, there is a descriptive name for each document. Future documents will include the project number and each submittal stage will be incremented. After you have filled in all of the forms, they need to be uploaded to the Mercer Island FTP site. But first you will need to include all of the supplemental documents into one file as separate entities. This file container may be an Adobe Acrobat portfolio, or alternatively a zip file. We will now demonstrate how to combine the supplementary documents into a single zip file in Windows. Other operating systems are similar. First, select all of the supplemental documents by holding down the control key and clicking each document that will be included in the zip file. Note that the plans have not been selected for inclusion in the zip file. They will be uploaded separately. Click on the Share Page tab. Now click on the Zip button. Now rename the created zip file with SUPP to indicate this zip file contains only supplementary information. Now we will upload the project plans and supplementary documents onto the Mercer Island FTP site. Open your web browser and navigate to sftp.mercergov.org. Type sftp.mercergov.org in the address box. You will need to log into the FTP site. Enter guest as the username and ePlan as the password. Type guest as the username. Type ePlan for the password. Click on the login button to access the Mercer Island FTP site. Click on the inbox link to open the upload folder. Click on the new folder button to create a folder specifically for your project. Create a new folder with your project's address. When your project is accepted for intake, you will receive a project number. This number is a unique project identifier and should be used for any subsequent submittals. Now click on the OK button to create your project folder. If the folder creation was unsuccessful, the highlighted area will provide information describing the reason it failed. Click on your newly created folder to upload your project. Click on the Upload Files button. Click on the Browse button to locate and select one of the two project files to upload. Let's select the zip file we just created, and upload it first. Click on the Open button to upload our subfile. And now repeat the procedure for the plans file. Finally, click on the Upload button to upload both of the selected files. Your files have now been uploaded and you will receive a confirmation email within 24 hours. For information on how to publish replies to ePlan correction comments using Adobe Reader, please view Tutorial 3. Thank you for participating in the Mercer Island ePlan review process on the cloud. If you have any questions, 
please check the Mercer Island website at www.mercergov.org for additional information on the MIE plan permitting process.